Good morning! Now I am in Yana, if I pronounce it well. And today, again, it's rainy! And you see that whenever I travel, I have rain. Right now we are going to see a castle in Yana town in Epirus area. The castle of Ioannina is the oldest Byzantine fortress in Greece. This castle was built in the 6th century. When it's rainy, what do you do? You know, you don't go out to the sea. Do you take a boat? I don't know. Or you sit on a sofa in your home and watching movies but right now we are taking a boat and we are going to an island this is the best thing to do on a rainy day am i right on the way to nisus yoninon island we will tell the story about kira fuzini a woman who was executed for adultery here by Ali Pasha. She was executed together with 16 other innocent women by drowning in this lake. Crazy, right? I will be telling you more about Ali Pasha later, so keep watching. But right now, let's go and see the island. Shops offer you to try food and drinks, and then if you like them, you can buy them. <laughs> it is a uh, lukumi, we call it also lukumi. It is with most grapes and uh, honey. It has nuts inside. Yes, walnuts. Mm. It's so tasty. Yummy, yummy. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye. Likere cranberries. cranberries. It's hot now. Did you like it? Very much. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it's hot, but it's tasty. It's good. <laughs> now this one is cinnamon. Okay. I don't like alcohol, but this one was tasty especially the cinnamon one maybe because i love love cinnamon most visitors come to this island to visit ali pasha's museum the former monastery where he was killed ali pasha was an ottoman ruler who was declared a rebel in 1820 and was killed in 1822. When you are in Epirus, you may hear his name often because during his ruling, the town of Ioannina developed into a major educational, cultural, political, and economic hub. He also killed one of his wives. I think I talked enough about this sad history. Let's leave this island behind and go somewhere else. We are actually going by this thing. This is not a boat, this is the platform. And usually they transfer car. But now we are going by this one instead of boat. I don't know why. Here is the driver. Okay. want to stop at all and that's why we're going to a cave 
to stay a bit dry. I think it's better. The cave of Prama is one of the most impressive and also one of the largest caves in Greece. I am sure in this cave, if they turn off all the lights, it should be so dark. This cave was discovered by accident in 1940 by residents. You can only visit this cave with a guided tour which takes around 45 minutes. Let's not forget Ioannina and in general Epirus is famous for its pies. Not only we had a lot of tasty pies, but we also learned how to make them. You should make the dough very very thin, then add some olive oil, spinach and cheese, then continue with another layer of dough. You can try making them at home. I can't promise it will be as easy as it looks. Same as always, thanks for watching and see you in the next video.